welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you a giant collective haul. So if you do not like hauls or you do not like video long videos, this is not going to be the one for you. So I just have been getting a lot of things that I have been wanting for a really long time and just haven't gotten yet. And they've all just been kind of piling up under my desk and I really want to get to start playing with them for you guys. But... I want to haul them for you first so you can see because I know a lot of people do enjoy hauls to see what's new or what um, deals there might be, so on and so forth. So I am going to go through it fast so that hopefully it won't be too long of a video. Um, for anything that is like eyeshadows and stuff like that, I will come back and do it again like in a smaller video. So I'm not going to be swatching anything today. I will show you the things, but um, I will do swatches separately like... A separate video just pertaining to that one product so first thing I wanted to show you is this book of jewels uh, baked eyeshadow library from Laura Geller I am going to be having um, a full review and first impressions on this with swatches coming to you shortly hopefully um, it's really cute it looks like a little bookcase it'll sit nicely anywhere and it just really is like little books they look really really cute and I'll just show you this one. This one is the Sapphires. So it has a mirror on each one of them. And then here are the baked little goodies. So really cool. Really excited to play with this one and show you guys um, swatches. And um, let me know if you want to look for that one too. Um, I can show you that as well. And then the next thing that I'm really excited about um, showing you is uh, the new It Cosmetics palette. So It Cosmetics has done a couple things. Um, they have done like their uh, contour palette. They've done the celebration palette and stuff. This is kind of an all-in-one palette. She has eyeshadow, blush, and lipstick in one palette. So one thing, I love It Cosmetics. I'm a huge, huge, huge supporter of It Cosmetics. Um, one thing though with this is the picture online is very deceiving. So, um, I got this back, I think when there was like a 25% off deal or 20%, sorry, something like that. Um, she does deals every now and then, especially for the holidays right now. Definitely check to see if you can get any deals. But it's very deceiving how big this palette is. I really thought it was going to be bigger. <laughs> Um, so I'm not sure about it yet, but I haven't swatched it, I haven't played with it, nothing. Um, it does come with a cute bow. It didn't have the plastic protective thing like the It brushes, so the bow is a little messy. Um, but it is still cute packaging, comes with a little gift note and stuff. And then, let me just show you the size of it really quick. So this is like her all-in-one palette. So it's really cute, looks like this. Um, but again, a little smaller than what I thought. Not that it's, not that it's small, it's just the picture makes it look a lot bigger. So I definitely want to be able to show you guys, you know, the difference and stuff. So I'll just give you a quick peek -see. Ooh, such goodies. And then there's more goodies inside of it. And it nicely all fits in like this little like compact size. So I'm excited, so excited to play with that and show you guys that. Um, very shortly and then the next thing I got is the it factor duo this is $24 I know you can get this at Ulta as well because I've seen it there but this is their duo of the vitality lip flush 4-in-1 reviver lipstick stain and vitality lip blush hydrating gloss stain with plum oil cherry oil shea, but shea butter argon and alba plus vitamins a c and e green and white tea, and aloe. So lots of great stuff in there, good for your lips. Um, it comes off kind of like a clear, and then it takes it takes color to what your lips are and then kind of shifts them. So it gets a your lips, but better literally for your lips. So it brings true on different people. But they are stains. I love um, it cosmetic stuff. I love the stain that it leaves after. Um, everything has wiped off already and stuff, so you don't have to worry about drinking and eating. Okay, next thing is, um, I did my eyeshadow today with this. Um, this is called Exposed 1. So they have Exposed 2 and 3 as well. 
and it's Naked Knockoffs. Um, I found this on Groupon. I wanted to try to see, um, put it next to the Naked palette because a lot of people can't afford the Naked palettes. They are expensive, you know, and it's like you want all of them. You can't like pick which one you want more. So I really wanted to try to see if there was a more um, friendly shopping version of it for other people. So on first looks, you guys, seriously, it looks identical, except for the fact that this packaging is more like um, the three and the two, where the one has that velvet package. That's about it. It does include the brush as well, but I mean, look at those colors. Seriously, it looks just like Naked One. So we will see. I'm going to do a separate review on um, testing them both out and doing swatches and stuff and seeing how similar they really are. So that is to come. Um, next thing is um, I went back to the Urban Decay store for um, to exchange something. And so I got the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide-On Pencil. Um, these are waterproof and I got this one in Deep End. It is like the most gorgeous teal ocean blue like you can think of. Um, I'll swatch this for you just because this doesn't need a separate video. But they glide on so smoothly. It's the most beautiful color blue. It has like a sheen shine to it. Oh, I just love it. Like it's so gorgeous. It's just going to be so nice if you want to put like a pop of color under your eye or something or you want to do like a really cool um, electric eye lick with the electric palette. I think this is going to be awesome to play with. Okay, next thing I got was um, an eyeshadow. And I've never gotten just a one um, pot eyeshadow from Urban Decay. I think they're kind of expensive. I know that, you know, they're really good quality. And they are going to last you a really long time. I don't think you'd go through a whole one too fast. Um, but it's just hard to, you know, like, oh, here's this. Oh, I get this. <laughs> um, uh, this is X literally just the letter X. This is what it looks like and you can depot these if you don't know. They do come out of these little shell mabobber thingies and you can pull them out. I'm not going to do it though because it's not working for me. So it's gorgeous though. It just has this beautiful like sheen and shine to it and it's just oh it's so pretty. Oh, It's like beautiful topper for anything. It can also just go on the eyelids so nicely. has such a sheen and shine to it. Really excited to have that. Okay, so a little while ago I told you that I went with my mother-in-law to the talk show um, where I got that glossy box and stuff like that. And I will um, leave it down below just in case you wanted to see that. But we also got some Kiehl's products. Kiehl's is, um, in Nordstrom is where I've seen it. I know that there are Kiehl's stores, like a mall near me has an actual store that is a Kiehl's store. Um, I don't see them around very often, but I know that they do have them. But this is just kind of your Bath and Body Works luxury stuff, but it's more natural. It's all natural stuff. Um, the things that are in it you can actually read uh, like this is soy milk and honey whipped body butter with shea and jojoba butters. It says this luxurious air whipped body butter is quickly absorbed to deliver rich hydration for wonderfully indulgent and addictive experience. Our soy milk and honey souffle is enriched with shea butter and squalene, squalene, squalene to help restore skin along with antioxidant enriched jojoba butter and beta carotene to protect and soften skin. So these, um, these to me don't have like a smell. They kind of, you know the original Vaseline that's like in a yellow container, an off yellow container kind of like this? It has that kind of smell where it just smells like, like natural. Like this one has a little bit of honey, but look at that whipped. Like, that is some serious whipping stuff. So I'm excited to try these and see um, see how it works, how it feels. And then I also have um, amino acid conditioner with pure coconut and jojoba oils. Silicone-free, paraben-free for all hair types. So it looks like that. 
and then also there is a shampoo for it same thing uh, pure coconut oil silicone free paraben free for all hair types so I'm excited to try that because I love the smell of coconut. So really pumped to try that. Uh, this is Creme de Corpse uh, Soy Milk and Honey Body Polish with Lufa Fruit and Jojoba Butter. So this it says massage onto moist skin and work into lather. Rinse gently enough to gentle enough to use every day for optimal hydration. Immediately follow with Kiehl's moisturizer of your choice. So it's like this um, scrub, so it's going to have like little polished beads in it and stuff to nicely scrub your skin. Okay. So moving on, more stuff. Um, I have Creme de Corps, uh Superb All Over Body Moisturizer with Superb Quality for extremely dry or flaky skin enriched with the finest ingredients known to Kiehl's for a rich, elegant skin texture. Continued use for 10 days will provide a skin texture here to for unattainable unobtainable I don't know so looks like this so got that and then a lightweight body lotion also from the creme de corps line and then a nourishing body washing cream with jojoba and shea butters so that is the set that we got so um, grateful that we got all that stuff. It was so nice of them um, to do that. So I'm really excited to try these products. If you've tried anything from Kiehl's, let me know. Oh, we also got um, Midnight Recovery Concentrate Serum. I am excited to try this. It does say that um, you'll see restored, visibly restore the appearance of skin by morning. So that's a big claim. My mother-in-law tried hers. She did not feel that way. So I'm going to try mine and see. We shall see. If you have um, any of these products, let me know how you like them. Or if you love Kiehl's, let me know what you use from Kiehl's. Um, I am new to Kiehl's, so I have no idea of what, um, what we have and don't have. So that was Kiehl's really quick. Kind of along the lines of body stuff, I made a purchase on Groupon for Yes to Carrots and I placed an order. So I'm going to show you what I got in my order. I got um, a grapefruit lip balm. This one is triple moisture with aloe and cocoa shea butter naturally, 99% natural, looks like that. I also got it in pomegranate and I ordered it in coconut but for some reason it didn't come. Instead I got this little itty bitty lip butter um, in Yes to Carrots and Berry Baby, Berry and Berry. So I'm going to call them and let them know <laughs> and see if there's anything they could do to help me get the coconut one because I really do want the coconut one. Um, and then I got a Yes to Carrots hand cream intense repair nourishing. Um, relieves dryness to soften skin and yes to soy to help retain moisture. Paraben free, also natural. And then um, I actually used this the other night just because I was downstairs and I felt my skin was just so dry. And honestly, I was too lazy to walk upstairs and get my moisturizer. Um, and the one I have downstairs has SPF, so I didn't want that. This is a repairing night cream. Um, yes to carrots, organic. Um with vitamin E for healing and hydration, paraben free, 98% natural product. Smells really good. It actually smells kind of like, um, it was thick. It is a thick cream, so a little goes a long way with this one. What did it smell like again? Oh, like a Cabbage Patch doll. You know how Cabbage Patch dolls have like kind of that baby powdery smell? It smells like that. So it was really nice to put on and it felt really good. And it really did moisturize my skin, so win-win. Um, okay, and then I got a Yes to you Grapefruit Correct and Repair Brightening Facial Towelettes. Um, I have had these before. I do like them, so I got that. And then I got a Yes to Blueberries Age Refresh um, Cleansing Towelettes with Apple and Lemon Peel to cleanse and moisturize all in one. I have not tried this one, but I'm excited to try. And then I've been dying to try this one, but my Target never seems to have them right now. Um, yes to Coconut Hydrate and Restore Cleansing Wipes. Uh, yes to Coconut Water and Kukui Nut Extract to Gently Cleanse and Hydrate. So there's the coconut ones. And then, I feel like I say that a lot in my videos. I'm really sorry. 
Okay, uh, natural sunscreen for kids, SPF 40, uh, broad spectrum. It's yes to cu cucumbers. It's soothing and it says water resistant for 40 minutes. Hypoallergenic, 97% natural. And then I got um, yes to carrots anti-frizz serum, hair treatment, avocado nourishing frizzy hair, mango butter softens and tames, yes to saying adios to frizz. <laughs> That's cute. Um, Paraben-free, 99% natural product. It says it's new, so give it a try. We'll see how it goes. And then, yes to carrots, hydration, and restore coconut oil body wash. Yes to coconut and apricot oils, apricot oils, to help cleanse your skin back to beautiful. 97% natural, paraben-free, coconut oil therapy, oil-rich formula. So it does look very thick and nice. Excited to try that. And then um, Yes to Carrots Blueberries Age Refresh Lip Line Reducing Lip Treatment. Tried this the other night. Feels fine. Nothing um, nothing fancy. We'll see how it works. Just a nice like clear um, little treatment. That one does not burn. My other lip treatment does burn a little. Uh, okay. I also picked up um, from... Groupon. I think it was Groupon. Um, a Michael Todd light. This is the blue and red light. This is the clear by light. Blue and red light acne treatment. Um, I've seen people use this for a long time. It's just, it's expensive. Didn't want to pay full price. It was on an amazing discount. I think it was like $59 or something like that. Um, so I picked this up to try to help me. I have the zip zip that something like that it's like a little white one but it's just so small so you have to hold it for a long time I kind of like this because it's bigger bigger surface area so I will try that and let you guys know what I think about it and if I would recommend it to you Groupon you guys have to check out Groupon I'm such a Groupon person it's hilarious how much I love Groupon okay I am going to do a um few things from um, Nordstrom Rack that I picked up. So one of the things I picked up is this purse. So big I can't fit it in the frame. I love it. It's so cute. It's a Steve Madden bag. Um, it was on sale for I think like 54 or something like that. Where's the tag? No tag? It has really cute detailing on the side. Look at these the zippers. And then it has the zipper and a pocket in front. Oh, I just love the details. And I am one of those people that sadly, I carry everything with me. It's kind of funny. Um, this was originally $108 and it was on sale for $59. So not a huge discount, but good enough for me. Cute little um, lining inside, plenty of room to fit anything you could possibly imagine or need. So excited to have this. <laughs> I, um, as you know from, if you watch my videos, I'm a lover of purses too. It's sad addiction. Okay, also from um, uh, Nordstrom Rack was the Too Faced things that I showed you in my Christmas guide. So this is one of them. This is the Pardon My French. This includes the Bonjour Summer palette, which like I said, if you have the Summer palette, there are a couple dupes in there for the Bonjour Summer as well. Um, or not dupes, exact same <laughs> ones. A uh, Too Faced eyeliner, a full size one, and then a deluxe size sample of the La Lash Injection and a sample of the Too Faced um, primer for your eyes. Really cute little bag that it comes in. It says Too Faced down here. I know you guys probably saw this a long time ago from people um, in the summer that got it, but I was really excited to get it because it was a huge discount. The discount was from $49 to $18.97. Oh yes, I will take it. Thank you. Have a good day. Okay, <laughs> so got that. Saved hugely on that. And then I also picked up, oh, here's the box for the exposed thing. And then I also picked up the All The Mode Eyes palette, which I also showed in my um, gift guide. I will also do reviews on these if you want, but you know what, no. I'm not gonna do reviews on the new Too Faced stuff I got because honestly, there's so many of them from summer. I saw them all the time, so 
I'm sure you could find one on there, but maybe I'll do a look with them or something one day. But again, great savings. $36 palette down to $14.97. Yes, please. Okay, and then I also picked up another um, La Creme lipstick. This is Color Drenched Lip Cream, Moist Rich, Lotus Flower, and Power Peptides. That's a lot of pose. Um, this one is in da, 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 Cinnamon Kiss, trying to go a little outside of my realm um, with a little bit more of a, like, berry color, we shall say. And then this one was $22 to $5.97. I love the lip creams, um, the La Creme, sorry. They feel really good on your lips, and for $5.97, really? Yeah, I'll take it. So I will show you my Makeup Geek ones. I got things like Bitten, a couple like that that I have not gotten um, before. And I love Makeup Geek, all things Makeup Geek. Love them. Um, I just threw that in there on accident because I said I was doing Nordstrom Rack, but Makeup Geek was in the bag, so sorry about that. Back to Nordstrom Rack. Um, this one was not really like sale, but they're not anywhere anymore. And I got the blue um, and the natural one. This one is the, uh, da, 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 da. I don't know the name for this one. What's the name for this one? I don't know. Anyways, it's the purple skinny palette. All of the skinny palettes came out um, a couple months ago, and I got the blue and the natural one, and of course, I wanted the purple one. But it was almost the same price. It was only cents off, but it's okay. It's only $15, so not bad. Okay, I got the Too Faced Smoked palette. This sells right now for $36 in Ulta and I believe in Sephora. And I got it for $14.97. So definitely need to check your Nordstrom racks. And then I also got a few more um, Urban Decay polishes. This is, I have two already. Um, I picked up the Pulp Fiction one in Miss Mia Wallace. This was the limited edition one. It's kind of like a berry burnt color. It looks like this so kind of like a burnt red maroon color and then I also picked up chaos which is the blue and then look at that that is so pretty I love the packaging I have to show you this so it has a skull on it I mean look how cute it is it has like this gunmetal color urban decay it has the UD on the front Oh, I just love the packaging of these nail polishes. They're so stinking cute. Okay, and then I also got one in Zodiac. This is an awesome color. I'm excited to try this. It's like glittery with all different kinds of colors and greens and golds and silvers. Um, really excited to try that. But I had to show you guys the packaging of Urban Decay nail polishes because they're so cool. Um, but again, again, these are usually $15 and they were $4.97, so five bucks. So you save 10 bucks. Um, I have noticed though that um, Urban Decay's website also does sell them for $5 too. So if you don't have a Nordstrom rack near you and you want some of those nail polishes, you can go check out the website. And then, okay, next thing is um, on Black Friday, I stopped by, um, I forgot to put this in my Black Friday haul, but it's okay. We'll just do it now. Um, I stopped by my local like beauty salon kind of place. It's called Second Street Beauty. Again, a uh, Groupon saved me. I think I paid like $19 for $35 worth of products. They don't carry all kinds of makeup brands, but they have Too Faced. They have um, Bare Minerals. They have um, a few other ones. Anyways, not too big of brands. Oh, Smashbox, they have two. So um, they also had a deal on the palettes. All the makeup stuff was 20% off on top of that. So I got one of the new Stila palettes. I wasn't going to get these because, again, it was so hard to pay so much money for a beautiful palette, but it was expensive. It's originally $48.99. I got it for like $25, so way better deal. I got the one in Spirit. I will be showing you guys that one because it's so nice. I really, really like it. And then I got this Murad um, AHA and BHA Exfoliating Cleanser. This is retailing for $46, and I got it for $10. So I was so excited about that. I love Murad products. Um, I think they work really, really well. And then they also have, like, nail polishes in an area that's, like, 
um, discontinued kind of stuff. So they had two SE nail polishes for $10, so $5 each. So these weren't a huge savings, but they're usually like $8.97 or something like that. So this one is Dive Bar, like a nice like peacock blue color. And then this one is Mambo. And it's like a nice like natural neutral color, but it does have a little shimmer in there if you can see that. Okay. <sighs> Next, <laughs> I uh, picked up a things from couple things from By Algory. I always get their emails. I've wanted Al Allegory. By Allegory. Yes. Um I always see like their emails. Sometimes they have really good deals on these because they are really heavy acrylics. Like I will give it to them. These are quality. I've bought a lot of acrylics from um like uh container store um some of them from like marshall's or tj maxx stuff like that but these are really good quality they are really heavy acrylics but of course they have them in colors so i had to get purple this is the lip gloss um carrier it has nice deep holes so you can actually stand them up and they don't wiggle around and this is their um lipstick one so really really nice size on that too so excited to have these i um been waiting a really long time to order these for a good deal um, and just money to want to spend on organization because I love organizing my makeup. I've been wanting for a really long time the perfect um, nude crayon yeah, from Too Faced uh, lip liner. Just again never wanted to spend that much money on a lip liner. They had a sale so I picked it up. And then um, one, it also came with um, two other little goodies in like a little deal set that they were giving away. It was a power plumping lip gloss from Too Faced, the lip injection. Um, I'm imagining this is going to be really sticky, so I'm probably going to give this away. And then uh, Too Faced Glamour Gloss. This is also volumizing with lip injection. This is in Sex Pot. <laughs> really cute name. So um, that came with it and then and then I am not going to unwrap them yet because I am going to do a separate video because I'm so excited. Um, I picked up the Makeup Geek Foiled Eyeshadows. I didn't pick them all up, it was so hard not to, but I just couldn't spend $100 on it at the moment. But I am so excited to play with these and show you so that will be a separate video. I'm not going to show you now. Then I also made my first purchase of ColourPop. Um, been seeing it everywhere. Love the colors. I am such a big lover of all things bright. They look so easy to use. They look so nice and smooth and luxurious. So I'm excited to try these. Um, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven um, eyeshadows. And then I got one lippy stick. So I'm excited to show you what I got. Again, separate review. I'm not going to show you everything. So sorry, Charlie. But um, I'm excited to show you guys all that stuff. Last, oh wait, one more thing before the last thing. I picked up um, the other day on Hot Look. They had, well not the other day, like maybe two weeks ago. They had Lorac on Hot Look. There's one more thing that still is coming, like um, one of their older palettes, little mini one. But I picked up this little eyeshadow um, from Lorac. This one is Delight. It's this really pretty purple. It has like um, Lorac and then they unscrew. So really pretty purple. Was really excited to try that. So I have got that in the mail yesterday. And then are you ready? Dun, dun, dun. Okay. I'm so excited to do this. There's a review going up tomorrow with swatches and um, my first impressions on the new Kat Von D Interstellar palette. Look at this. I, I can't even really show it to you guys because it's reflecting so much. Interstellar power. It's so cute. It has all these shadows. I didn't pick up um, any of the chrysalis ones. Um, things like that because at the time I just couldn't afford it but um, I'm excited to have this one we shall see I shall open and do first impressions and swatches for you tomorrow so come back and subscribe if you're not subscribed so you don't miss any new videos because there's gonna be so many things coming because I'm not buying in January because I'm going my wallet needs a vacation 
really. Um, and then I just entered the code Remedy again to get uh, another one of the blemish treatments from Bare Minerals before those are gone. And then I also picked up um, the lashes top to bottom from Clinique because it has the mini um, size of the under the lower lash line uh, mascara and I'd be dying to try it but I haven't bought one um, in the full size so I'm dying to try it to see if it's good and it was like $16.50 so really excited to try this. Whew. We made it! Haul is done! Giant collective haul. Thank you for sticking around. There is <laughs> sadly to say an Alta haul and a Sephora haul. I just wanted to bleep this to you so that you knew to come back tomorrow. Um, but I'll show those to you guys later. I used my 20% off and then um, just a few things that I got from Sephora like over a month ago almost. Um, so I will see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate your love and support. Keep leaving me comments. I love talking to you guys. And subscribe if you're not subscribed. And give this video a thumbs up if you like to go shopping and you like to see hauls. Bye guys.